hello 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 welcome back to my channel with lupita Ide. thank you so much for stopping by today i am gonna be bringing to you guys my actually it's my snowball not my avalanche okay here we go i've been doing the avalanche in the past so i got confused so we're going to be doing our snowball and the reason why I am doing the snowball is because I'm trying to finish a credit card that now is at 0% and it's going to be over in September. So I want to make sure I finish that before September ends so I won't get charged any interest. If you are new to my channel, welcome back. My name is Lupita. I am a single mom of four children. And I am currently working on my debt-free journey. Um, I did start it, my debt with about 1200 uh, when I started sharing my journey in YouTube. Uh, but prior to that, it had been higher. I will bring it down and it will go back up. At one point, I was around 6000 and then I brought it back up. To like 14 and so on I've been struggling with my debt because I had nobody to hold me accountable or to be question not not questioning but I didn't have no support system so I once I started YouTube I started having all this um, and it was not too long ago like four months ago that I started having all this support which I love and that has encouraged me to continue working even harder on my debt-free journey sometimes I think we need a little bit of motivation to accomplish our goals and you guys have given me all of that motivation so again if you're new to my channel welcome i would love for you to become part of our journey or my journey but i would like you to come along with me so don't forget to click that subscribe button and also the bell so you can get a notification every time i upload a video so today is monday i worked last night i woke up a little bit too early and I'm not sleepy. I went ahead and ate. And now I was like, okay, I have 30 minutes. I should just go and record my video. So to because I work tonight. And like this, when I come from work tomorrow morning, I can just edit it and share it with you guys. So just have in mind that by the time you guys are watching this video, I did record it the day before. I am using my um, washi. Uh, you can find this if you're interested on lupitasstickyshop.net. I am combining it with this one, which is the Snowball Method Tracker. Which I just made as well. And I am learning how to do the icons and all of that. Um, this one, I did it in... Um, silhouette and this one was done also in silhouette but then if you purchase from my shop you will get you will be getting a freebie which is this one this one was done in Cricut I feel like because I have the subscription with Cricut I am able to use a lot of their icons that they already have so I don't have to download them from anywhere I still am using the basic edition for silhouette so I don't have access to a lot of things now this one I did create this little credit card on Adobe and then I created the money dollar the dollar bills as well in Adobe so these are of mine and these two I got them from uh, Cricut's design space. I decided to combine the two because it has blue in it and I think that the colors go with each other. So I have good news. Okay, I made a payment last night while i was at work um if you watched my 
52 my 52 week challenge video you will see that i had money left part of that was money that i had for my cash envelopes and weekly challenges i had a little bit left over and then my son-in-law started providing for rent so part of that uh, was used on my savings challenge on that video and the rest was put aside and i decided to use it towards my debt now that is not budgeted in my income when i first did my monthly budget i did not add it to any budget because i was not sure if i was going to get it it was not a for sure thing but because i did receive it i decided to add it to the debt so in a moment you guys will see how much is it that i threw to my debt so i am gonna start with my smallest car which is the car that i want to finish as soon as possible which is capital one and here the balance is as of last night 331 and 63 cents my apr here is zero percent and my minimum payment is 25 dollars um walmart we have a balance of 778 and 60 cents and i have an apr of 22.90 and my bat my minimum payment is 28 and now we're gonna go to costco which i have a balance of one thousand six hundred eighty seven and twenty four cents and my apr is fifteen point twenty four percent my minimum payment here is fifty dollars and this is just an estimate because it has been on the 40s 50s and I'm gonna be honest, I've been throwing 60 every time, even though it's 54, 56. I just have been rounding it up to the 60. But this time I'm just gonna leave it in between, not not in the 40s, not in the 60s. So I'm just gonna leave it at 50. Um, and then we have Shop Your Way which it used to be Sears for those of you that didn't know it is now 1795 and 80 cents and my APR here is 25.24% and my payment is 120 it is an automatic payment um that was set up at the beginning when I opened this um, line or well, this credit. I already had the credit and it was already finished. It was paid off, but they offered me the same amount, which was 4,000 with zero interest. But I did have to um, set up a payment and be automatic payment. So my regular payments for this car should be around the 50s. But because at the beginning I set it up as to be 120, that's why it's always 120. Um, Best Buy. My balance here is 2,749 and 42 cents. My APR here is 21.74% and my minimum payment here is 80. it is 79 but i'm running it rounding it to 80. and that is all you guys i have brought my debt to 
five credit cards, which I think it's great compared to the credit cards that I had at the beginning. Here's just a little sneak preview of September last year. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. Eight cards in September were down to one, two, three, four, five. And after this month, we're going to go to four. And here is why. So, last night I gave a payment. Here we go. I don't know how we're going to do this, but I'm just going to put here. Last night was the 9th. So, and just in case you guys are interested on the pens, I am using the Artesa Roll Rollerball Pen 0 0.5 Needle. And then I'm switching to my Pilot G-207. I hardly tell you guys what I'm using. I'm not used to it. Sorry. So for August 9th, 2020, I gave a payment to Capital One of a hundred and sixty six which was what i had left over on the video that i mentioned earlier which was my 52 week challenge so that went towards capital one and now i'm gonna show you guys what is my snowball okay so my snowball my regular snowball okay so here i'm just gonna put my my regular snowball is 500 but this was before i added this card to the snowball because in previous months you guys will not see this card i didn't include it because it was a zero interest and i didn't see it as oh i need to work hard on that one yet i saw like i still had time and i didn't want to use my 500 dollars towards that card so now so i always use 500 plus the 25 that i was already giving so it is 525 for my snowball okay now this is an extra payment so i'm just gonna put here extra now let's do the math you can do your snowball however you wish however you feel comfortable this is the way i'm doing it this month uh so it's 25 plus 28 plus 50 plus 120 and plus 80 that will give me a total minimum of 303 and that is my minimum payment so if we deduct those 303 from the regular payment that i do monthly that will leave us with 222 okay so this will be my snowball okay Now, if we combine this with this, it's going to give us a total of 166, well, 222 plus 166. It's going to give us a total of... three hundred and eighty eight okay this this means that I'm gonna knock out this okay so three eighty eight minus three thirty one point sixty three is gonna leave wait 
Okay, so this with this is 388 plus my minimum. Okay, so plus Oh, see. So we have 388 plus 25. We have 413. Yeah. So it's going to be 413 minus 331. So this is how it's going to be. Okay. So I'm going to be giving the 25 plus the 388. Okay. And that's going to close it. Okay. And I'm going to have $82 left, which is going to go here. So here I'm going to give this plus 82. So that's how my snowball is going to look for this month. I just hope I did it correct. Yeah, I think so. Let's add up our debt as of now. So it is 3 3,161.60 seven, plus 1,687.24 plus 1,795.80 plus 2,749.42 that gives us a total of 7,342 with 69 cents minus 413 that will leave us on the 6,000s guys now I am not going to see the 6,000s for September yet because remember that this is my total in paper, but I will still have to wait for them to charge me the interest. So probably I'm still going to be on the 7,000s by September. Hopefully not, but at least we see progress. And that is the important thing. Okay, so I just noticed as I was editing that my number was incorrect my total amount that i will be putting into debt it's going to be 691 dollars and i noticed it because uh i didn't finish adding my additional and i also noticed because on capital one i had put 388 and it was not 388 so i did fix that it is 306 for capital one plus a minimum that will finish the that card and then what's left which is the 82 dollars will be going into walmart so that gives us the 388 that it will be going as extra then i added with the 303 that i was already originally going to give so putting it together gives us the 691 and then I went ahead and compared it with my other numbers, which is the extra 166 and the snowball 222 plus the minimum payment 303. And that also gives us the 691. So that's how I know for sure that that is going to be our total amount given to my debt. I am so, so, so excited for that. I am so excited. I am so happy just the fact that my debt is decreasing it doesn't fit I was trying to like make it fit but no and that a lot of it it's thanks to you guys um, 
don't forget if you guys are interested on the stickers you guys um i have not made stickers like other shops where they do kits monthly i am still learning as i go um, I will work on future stickers and on this week I'm going to be off the rest of the week after tonight. So I have a lot of time to design stickers for September, October, and November. I'm going to try to do those three months. But just know that I will be sending this little freebie, which I think it's very useful. Um with your orders so if you do order you will receive one of those and thank you thank you for supporting me you guys have been supporting me either by watching my videos liking my videos commenting on my videos that is already supporting me that is already giving me um a way for me to work harder so i want to appreciate that and also if you've shopped from my shop thank you thank you so much i do want to film another behind the scenes another um packing my orders kind of thing but i need orders for that to happen so that's what i'm going to be working on this week um I've been debating whether I'm going to do those on this channel or just continue doing them on my other channel. Um, I have been thinking about it this week. Um, I do videos because I like to do them, not so much because of the pay. If I wanted to get more money, I would just be doing them in this channel. But I kind of want to have, have them separate and i don't know i would like your opinion on that where would you guys want them i want this channel to be strictly about budgeting and the other channel it's literally about everything so yeah so thank you again for watching i'll see you guys on my next video bye bye